what's up guys welcome back to beauty with ty so today's video is going to be on this half up half down style i will show you guys how i achieved this style without any leave out and how you can get these curls bombed straight out of the pack all right let's get started <music> Okay guys, so the hair I received is from Glam Cam Hair. It came with a lot of goodies like this edge control, balm, smells good too. It came with an edge brush as well, a little brochure letting you know about the hair, some balming lashes, a cap, a bag, and a little pouch. These are the bundles here. They have an ombre to them as well as the closure um, has the same curl pattern of that deep curly hair. All right, so this is what the hair looks like, plus all of the goodies that I received. Like I said, it was so many things that came in this package. Like you can tell, they put a lot of work into that packaging. All right, so I'm showing you guys my braids, old but good. <laughs> so I went ahead and took out the first couple so I can do the half up, half down, and keep the rest braided back for the um, sewing I will be doing in the back. So I'm going to go ahead and comb through my hair. As you can see, it's a little hard. So I'm going to take some of my handmade hair cream and use that as a detangler. It's not just a moisturizer or to promote hair growth. It's all of the above. I love to use it to help detangle my hair. I just rub it in until I get it to melt into my hand and then distribute it all over my hair and that way it's easier to comb through my hair. If you would like to purchase just click the link down below so that you can go ahead and head over to my Etsy account so that you can purchase this bomb cream. Alright so back into the style I'm going to go ahead and put my hair in a ponytail and use this cap that came with the packaging so that I can just protect my hair as much as I can. Um, this option is just optional so here i'm showing you guys i did go ahead and co-wash the hair so that i can already have the hair dried and the curls popping other than that you will have it more uniform and have to do it on your head but i didn't want to i want to make sure i get the most definition out of the curls so i washed it and just let it air dry so here i'm showing you guys that i will be sewing the hair in the back pretty simple just going across from side to side sewing in the hair to help me hold the hair since I'm doing it myself I like to pull the hair over and put a hair pin in it and then I'm able to continue to sew the hair without the hair falling or have to keep pull it over that's a little helpful tip for you if you are doing the sewing yourself other than that you just want to keep on going side to side until you work yourself all the way up to the top when I get up to the top here I'm showing you guys I just have a little bit of hair left and the normal way is for you to just pull it around how we've been doing it from side to side however I'm going to do it a different way so I'm going to start off by taking a little bit of the hair sorry my parts isn't as straight because I was doing it in the shower when I previously prepped my hair so I'm just going to take a little piece and make that more like my perimeter braid of course you can do this at the beginning if you like but i decided to do it here so here i'm going to flip the hair the opposite way so that i can pull the hair back without my track showing this is the way i do it without having to leave any leave out so once i sew that one across i go back in with another track and sew it down the correct way which is pretty much going back normal and then I'll take that hair and pull it back. So that way it's kind of, you can't see the track. It kind of more so look like crochet. So here I'm showing you guys, this is the edge control. It is black. Like it goes on black, but then it eventually starts to dry clear. I really, really love this edge curl edge control i used it before i did this style when i was doing a ponytail so i used just the edge control and then i went back with some um gorilla snot and y'all it really held my edges like with a lot of edges i do have to add a second product on top but y'all look at this if you have like thin edges you definitely should look into um this edge control like it was bomb but it doesn't stay black so that's the only thing like if you do have thin edges it's not going to stay black and um here i just used the edge control solely by itself but when i did my ponytail it was really cute and sleek i added some gorilla snot on top which was like perfect 
but um i wish i would have added some product on top but i didn't just for the sake of this video and showing you guys the edge control so then i take a piece of hair and just wrap that around the bun i want it really fluffy and like just you know free so that's all i did and this is the end of the style you guys let me know what you think about this look and how easy you think it was um let me know what else you would like to see here but in the meantime make sure you click the link down below so you can go and check out glam cam hair comes with a lot of things i love their packaging and their hair is bomb as well you can color this hair if you like as well or you can keep it the natural color all right guys thank you for watching please thumbs up this video and have a good day